Hey, Dr. Stone here for Doc Sports, and today is Thursday, January the 12th, and I'm back with more free play action. Unfortunately, did not get the free play yesterday, uh, both ways, so see if we can uh, correct that today. Uh, just uh, Chicago just had a t terrible third quarter, did me in, okay, or did us in, and uh, so not good on the free play, and uh, the and Mississippi State had a lackluster performance Georgia was almost I almost took them yesterday, so I was a little curious about that. But hey, that's can't do anything about that. We move ahead and try and get some more winners today. And I got a couple of plays lined up, ready ready to go just for that, and see if we can make that make that happen today. Uh, what's going on today? Well, let's see here. Today we've got a six unit play in the NHL. That's right, a six unit play in hockey. I have won four in a row this week. We started on Sunday and it takes me to thirty eight and twenty seven, almost fifty nine percent on that. <clears throat> and uh, with the NHL. So let's see if we can nail down one. I got, a, like I said, a six unit play, and that's available at the Dialstone page at Doc Sports. And you can take advantage of that. And uh, yesterday, ha had a disappointing day. Uh, Indiana State somehow, no, well, I shouldn't say somehow, it was it was odd. I wasn't able to watch the game because I was handicapping games, but uh, that, that was my seven unit play yesterday. It was no good as it turns out. And they were, I think, outscored by 18 points at the free throw line at home. That seems like a rarity. So the only thing I can figure is that Southern Illinois scored inside more, but you know, to, to have all those free throws. But that was uh, that was the thing. So I see if I look to see if I can find that somewhere on ESPN Plus or something, and see if I can at least see what happened. But curious about that. So went one and two all together yesterday. So looking to bounce back for all the people that bought that yesterday. By the way, thank you to everyone that did. So look, like I said, looking to bounce back with that one and and uh, make something happen. Okay, right there. So we've got a triple play going on Thursday in college basketball. And uh, in the NBA, uh, had the five-unit winner on the Bucks last night. So that just came in. It got close, like I thought it might, but then they pulled away at the end, so they would have covered the spread anyways. But I like the protection of, of, of what the money line offered. I thought they'd win the game, and they certainly did that. So that was good. So I'm coming back with a first-half play tonight for on Thursday night in the NBA. Again, all available at Dr. Stone page at Doc Sports. And along with that, today's Thursday. So that means we got football coming your way. So I have wild card football picks for you this weekend. Uh, looks like three plays is going to be what it, what I'm going to end up with and including a seven unit best bet. All of those are available at Dr. Stone page at Doc Sports. And you can, if you've never been to, to Doc Sports, you can sign up for $60 worth of free plays. And take care of business that way. $60 for the free plays. Any of the things I just mentioned, you can get, or get the weekend package for football, whatever you want to do. All you do, go to my page, go in the upper left-hand corner, fill out that red box uh, in, in the upper corner, left-hand corner, and you are good to go, okay, with $60 worth of free picks. And also, again, thank you for watching and subscribing to the channel. And if you have not subscribed, please do so. Okay, it takes nothing. Sit where it says the subscribe button, click on that, and you're on your way. Okay, and you don't have to do anything absolutely free. And you're getting only my picks, but the picks of, all, of the other guys at Doc Sports as well. And if you like what you hear, that's what the like button's for. Simple as that. All right, let's get today's free play. I'm talking NBA. Uh, this is the 76ers' last home game before they go on a five-game Western streak. And I'm not sure they're going to be completely focused on this one. On Tuesday, Philadelphia massacred Detroit by 31 points, shooting 60.7%. That was their second-best shooting percentage of the year. Uh, though not a huge moneymaker, um, teams that shoot over 60% in their previous game, and they're a favorite of more than seven points. It's a moneymaker, okay? So just keep that in mind, and that's what I'm thinking about here. Speaking of making money, how about the Oklahoma City Thunder? 25 and 16 against the spread, which is the second best in the second best record in the NBA. The Thunder are also a sharp 39 and 21 uh, versus teams that make 46% or more of their shots and 21 and 10 this season as an underdog. Uh, the point spread in this affair would seem to suit how uh, oh, the Thunder play, okay, at nine and a half, because they are 18 and seven against the spread as a road underdog of six and a half to 12 points. So I'm going to say take Oklahoma City plus the nine and a half over Philadelphia today. So 
that's my free play there. Again, a quick recap. I got football coming at you, okay? I've won seven of the last eight weeks in the NFL, and my big plays in football are on a 9-2-1 and one run. So keep that in mind. You'll hear about it again. Okay, you can be assured of that. Along with that, six-unit best bet go tonight in the NHL. Looking to improve on uh, trying to make it five in a row and take my record to 39-27. and 27. Okay, out of my last 65 picks to this point. Have that plus NBA uh, first half play, one, one that I really like tonight, along with a triple play. Uh, in college basketball. So all available at the Gupson page at Doc Sports. The college game, okay, is a place that place that I've been, okay, uh, pretty often, actually. Um, it, from the West Coast Wise Guys, got, they have Milwaukee, the University of Milwaukee, Wisconsin, as it used to be called. It's actually now just called Milwaukee University, minus the one, okay, in their battle for first place in the Horizon League tonight. So there you have it. That's everything I got for you for today. I'll be back on Friday with more free play action. This is Doug Upstone. Until next time, I'm out.